Salvia uliginosa at growplants.org, also known as bog sage. This herbascus uh, it per- can grow as perennial evergreen or annual plant. Uh, you can grow it also in a subtropical, mediterranean or, to- tropic- or temperate climate. Hardiness zone, uh, 8 to 11 as perennial. And if you want to grow it as an annual plant, it can be from 5 to 8. If you would like to grow it, there is a link below, link is right top side. And this is a donation for the channel if you purchase it. Also, don't forget to subscribe, it's helped to this channel growing. So, uh, mostly it's grow for uh, the beautiful flowers. Also for the leaves are nice, uh, not very ugly or something like this. Nice leaves, not... Uh, they create... Uh, the leaves grow uh, five, uh, five together and create a head structure or something like this. The blue flowers with the white aprons are quite of lovely, uh, but uh, when you grow it, it attracts a lot of pollinators, so be aware of this. Uh, this is beautiful and useful for your garden. It requires well-drained soil. You can start to grow it by seeds, plant, or just cutting. Uh, be aware that it's really easy to start from seeds to grow. It's invasive plant. Uh, best season to start to grow it will be in the spring, but possible in a hotter climate or not as annual. Annual, it's only in the spring. If you grow it as a perennial from the spring to the autumn, it's possible, but the best will be in the spring. Major pests are the aphids and also spider mites can be a little bit annoying. The height of the plant can be from 5, uh, 50 cm to 1 meter, so it's been like 20 to 40 inches. Uh, pruning, uh, it's just for design, the best season to do it, it's after the blooming, so it's been uh, in the winter, mostly. This plant requires average amount of water, and in the right condition, it's a medium speed growing plant. It uh, can grow in full sun to half shade. Better, will, uh, better result of blooming will be in the full sun. Uh, blooming season. It's from the summer to the autumn and uh, the shape of the flowers, as you can see, it's a denser shape. Except this, it's not very hard to grow, there isn't special requirement. It's a strong plant that attracts a lot of pollinator- pollinators, the flower colors are blue, so it's unique in, your, in the garden, I think. So it's something to consider, because if you choose to grow plants, uh, I highly recommend uh, to have a uh, flower cement. Uh, to have different kind of flowers, it's uh, attract more attention to your garden. And if you want, there is other kind of flowers that look uh, the same kind of shape with other colors, like other salvia. Salvia hot lips, for example, it's a good example. But this is beautiful and you should consider to grow it. That's all from growplants.org. Don't forget to subscribe, visit our website. And of course, if you have any question, just ask. You have here links about more videos some list, subscribe, and of course purchase a plant and this is donation for our channel. I hope you enjoy and come visit us again.